use Killy Foil Lake. Oh, Killy Foil. What color is that place there? Yes, is there Ross, any? Ross Brick Glebe is where John and Patrick and Margaret and Kate and Emily were and Nellie were born. All they were all born right here. I wonder where. What, what do you call it? Lost Mitch? What do you call it? That's right over by the the lake, Kitty. What Killy Kill, 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 Kill. It's ah, it's right yeah, over. It's it's just. See, I didn't know the town land of it. Half a mile, just a half a mile or so up there. Oh, and then there was other boys in Maravilla. There was two men. I I they used to, there were huntsmen that lived in the cottage house before you went into Maravilla. Yeah, I don't know. That may be why um, Patrick. Uh, Patrick and, and Ann Slowey, uh, John Boyle's parents. Uh, Who were their Slowey? He he worked on a on he was a, a laborer yeah. on there. Ah, and that's where all the kids were born right yeah. there. That'd be who was that that was born there? All all these ones here before they moved in. Well, yeah, Kate, <laughs> Kate, John Boyle, your grandfather. Grandpa. Ellen Nellie Boyle, she went to the States, Kansas City. Patrick Boyle, I don't know anything about him. I don't know if he died as a young child or I don't know. Well, my father about my him. father had a brother, he died when he was a child. So he did die when he I was a Thomas, child. He was Tommy. Tommy. Thomas. Um your father, John Boyle? His brother. He had a he, brother. There was a child in the nineteen eleven Census, it says she had had six children, only five were living. Yeah. So, his name was Tommy? Tommy. That's how I was called Tommy. After him? Yeah. Tommy. But he's dead, you see. Oh, yeah. He, he died very young. Okay. That's good to know. Um... Uh, where do you get all this outfit? Um, a lot of it from the government records office, um, uh, public records office of Northern Ireland, public yeah. records office of the Republic. I see across the border there. Uh, the general uh, register in the Republic and the general register in Northern Ireland. In Northern Ireland. Um, church records. Yeah. Uh, like um, you did a lot of a church fellow, record stuff, it, didn't you? There was a fellow that uh, transcribed all the birth records from 1866 to 1880 of Sacred Heart here in Clonus, and uh, uh, lots of that information off of that. Now some of this, like Kate Boyle, this is from. Kate Boyle married a fellow named Lawrence Hickey, and they lived over out of the Kansas City, Missouri area. Um, Do you ever run across any of them now? You know, I can't find them now. Um, you were easier to find them. Than them. <laughs> <laughs> I can't find oh, them. Oh, so you could have lost me, you know. <laughs> I can't find... I. I, I I have letters from uh, Stapleton, from Thomas Stapleton, and, and um, they changed addresses and they changed uh, street names. Yeah. You know, they used to be rural route, and now they've got something Boulevard. And I just haven't found any of them. Well, that's, that in that graveyard, that's our grave, and that's for my mm -hmm. grandfather's buried and my other and yeah. some of my aunts in that grave. Yeah, we um. Which aunt? Your mother's? No, no, my mother's. My mother's one there were back down in in Orbishani. You see, she was flood. My my mother was flood. Flood. Ah. What is the way? Which aunts? Which aunts are in the? Oh, they would have been. Oh no, it wouldn't oh, be. Oh, they would have been Rose. They would have been. Uh, yeah, Nora. Kathleen. No, I didn't see my father's wife was Kathleen by. Right. Uh, you know, now your father had a sister named Kathleen. Yeah, but the, my father, there was Nora and Lizzie and uh, Kathleen. Uh, okay, okay. And Annie. There was an Annie one. Mary Elizabeth uh, 
in a letter that that. But them's old dead, them people. Oh well, yeah. yeah. Ah. But Mary Elizabeth, uh, yeah, in one of the letters, it said she went to England and got married, or got married and went to England. Yeah, she, she, she packed me Alfred, was that the one? Oh. So. Well, you should show. But them. this Mary McCaffrey said that she was living over there above Killyfoyle, Killyfoyle Lake. Oh, but she's dead. Yeah, I know. Ah. But I thought she might have some children. Oh no, there was no, no children. No children. Pat, because Pat McCaffrey was married before, you see, and he was a widow man, and she she was a right good age one. Mm -hmm. There was no children. That <laughs> all all the children, it'd be. It'd be my father, because the other, the, my, my aunt, uh, my aunt Annie, she was bad, crippled with pains. You know, she couldn't walk hardly with pains. Pain. Ah, uh, that was Roseanne. Yes, that's Roseanne. And, uh, and Kathleen. Is there a Nora one there too? Nora, yeah. Nora uh, died in 1929. Yeah, so before uh, I was born. That's the census here, is it? Well, that's some of the stuff. But see, this is a letter. This is a letter from Mary McCaffrey to Margaret Boyle Cassidy in the States. Ah, you see, there was there was Boyle's married to Cassidy's too, was it? Yeah, that's Margaret. Her, would she? Her, her daughter is living in St. Louis now. Yeah. She's um, like 81 or 82. Ah. The, the, she's my generation. She's our generation. Uh, I, some of them was married to Cassidy below Rosle. Um, yeah, I don't know how. But you know, I was thinking what it'd be. It, well, your man, you know, the president, the last president, well, Clinton, he was supposed to be related to Cassidy's below Rosle, and I was wondering <laughs> what it'd be the same. <laughs> That's right. Oh. Aye, Clinton, man. So I, I don't know. I know what it is. I said, I keep up all these things. Well, it's, uh... Aye, Cassidy, did you get it? Had you it married? Well, we, had, we had pictures on the wall, and it was friends of my father was married to Cassidy's in America. That must have been the same ones. Um, well, Margaret Jane, here is Margaret Jane, uh, your grandfather's sister, and she married a Patrick J. Cassidy. Yeah. He died in 1930. Yeah. And then they had uh, George Cassidy, John Cassidy, Mary Agnes Cassidy, James Francis, uh, Mary, and then Mary Agnes married a James Francis Ruder, and Margaret Cassidy, uh, who would have been our generation, yeah, uh, married a Bernard Flott, who was a doctor, and then she had Mary Patricia and Margaret Jane. She's the one that that yeah. I've been to see in St. Louis. She married a Richard Olson. You see, the name followed all them the Christian names. You see, they <laughs> kept all in the Christian names there. Yeah. There's, uh, well, my mother's name is Margaret. Yes. Both of her grandmothers are named Margaret. Yeah. And one of her great, and both of her great grandparents are named Margaret. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you see, but tell me someone. What boy now? Is it my grandfather's brothers? Is that the way you? How are you related, Dan? Um. Okay. Well, here's your father, John Joseph yes. Boyle, born in 1910. That's right. Okay. My father married Emily, and and he married. Uh, wait a minute here. Kathleen. This John Boyle here. And my grandmother, he's a brother, and the grandmother's a sister. What boy is that? Is that this is your grandfather? This is your grandfather. Yes. 
So your grandfather and my grandmother are the siblings. Same sibling. Yeah. They, they, they have brother and sister. Yeah. Brother and sister. So we're related through the sister. And so so my father and your John yeah. Joseph was the same generation. Yeah. Right. And then you and I are the same generation. Oh, is that it? Yeah. yeah I'm but 75. I'm, I'll be 80 at Christmas. So we're just... I was born in 38, and you I were born a little 33. sooner. 33. So, yeah. 20 of December, 33. So it's... His grandfather and your grandmother oh, were siblings. siblings right. yeah. And so we're descended through the mother. Yeah. Which would be your grandfather's yeah. sister. Yeah. So. Well, well <laughs> you may quite walk to get a hurt to me. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. That's Tara. Right. Well, I've been working on this for five or six years trying to get information. Yeah. And it's just uh, like Patrick, he just disappeared. I don't know don't know where he is. Would you know where they might be buried? Your great grandparents would be would they be over there at at um, like this uh where I don't see maybe. Yeah, right. All right. Adam uh, C. Yeah. Okay, they're there. Yeah. Okay. I but thought see, they might be. You see, they could be there. But I get my glasses. I can't see without glasses. Oh.